Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your boy Charles Young, man, also known as Open Thoughts. Hey, check me out on OpenThoughts.com. Um, check this out, man. This is about a series. I'm back at you again with a series of ideas and thoughts that you possibly can take and you know use and apply instead of just listening to all this information. Um, one thing I wanted to talk about is going back to us as African Americans or black or whatever the hell you want to call yourself, you know. Um, I'm looking at a lot of different things. I seen this video the other day, and um, it's a company that created the hoverboard, and you know it was very interesting to me. And I'm looking at the fact that a lot of a lot of us don't understand that we are the founders and creators of science and technology. But the thing about it is, just to say it and not be involved in it is retarded. I mean, there's a lot of people in the conscious community who talk about being the creators of science, mathematics, and all these great wonders that we had, and it's very it's, it's miraculous, but if we don't imp apply the information to our creation in a society, it doesn't mean anything. A lot of uh, individuals are still holding on to, especially black, the back in the day type mentality. Yes, I understand we have to get, understand our past as an American, in, a, in, Ameri in American society, but we can't just keep holding on that. We can't just keep going back to 12 years of slave and roots. We can't just keep staying on that, harboring on that, because people are creating society. People are creating this new world, and we don't have our foots in it. You know, I do comedy, but, you know, I don't want to just be a person that's just an entertainer and making people laugh all the time. Me and being, it's great. Of course, I love to do that. You know, I think it's a great thing. And if you have a skill and a goal that your talent, use that, but use it to go to create the next generation. I don't want to be just an individual who is just, just a joke, man. You know what I'm saying? And not understand the business, the importance of it, and then allow somebody else to control me and what I do in my society, which I'm not going to let that happen. But you got to understand, you got to understand that we have to get into other areas. And especially with technology, they're creating so much. People are getting funding for so many ideas. And it just seems, I'm not saying it is, but it just seems that as black people, we're so harboring on when we go to church on Sunday, what we do wrong, uh, who got this, who got that. And we're not looking at that our future is being created for us. I live in Phoenix, Arizona, where there's a lot of individuals who are Hispanic and you know they're picking up that they're picking up oh I could better get it in, in get in gear and I'm looking at it as I want to learn Spanish because I ain't trying to be a person that you know five ten years down the road everybody around me is, is Hispanic and I can't get a job or I can't be in these positions because I'm not a bilingual speaker so it's either you evolve with the times or you stay behind and that's the whole thing you're gonna be left behind you can believe it in the Bible sense if you want to but it's going to happen in reality. You're going to be left behind. It's just like older people who it's good that some of them know how to text. But think about the old, the other older people who never experienced that having a phone. You know, they can't even put, do an email. They don't even know what that's like. And what the society is now, you got 90-year-old people working jobs. You have 80-year-old people working jobs. And you know what I'm saying? Social Security is not really going to help. So how I feel is that we as African-Americans need to understand that we are important in this society. We need to create more. We need to create more. We need to be more creative and stop dwelling on the past. Um, as videos go on, I'm going to touch on this a little bit more so we can understand exactly what I mean. So thank you for listening, man. Back at it. This is this is Open Thoughts. Back at it again. Check out OpenThoughts.com. I got a lot of comedy videos. I got a lot of stuff on there. And I definitely want you to see I'm doing stand-up events. I'm doing everything. So, you know... I'm just going to keep it rolling and hopefully I can encourage you to be something. All right, peace.